Hi, and now uh, welcome back to another logo tutorial. Uh, in this tutorial, you guys can see these uh, beautiful graphics. So, and uh, I believe you must be wondering how this uh, graphic uh, was put together. So, what I'll do next is uh, to actually show you guys how I've managed to put together this tra graphic. So, let's go to the programming area so that you see how it was all put together now I'm going to start a fresh one and you see how it was done okay to start with uh, I'll start with these very lines of code that you guys are seeing there so that's the name of my command and um, size so which means you can enter whatever size you want it's going to be repeated three times then uh, the size that you enter is then fed into FD and um, the rotation will be to the right and that's 120 so what I'll do next is go to file and save then come in here and just uh, write out my command I believe the name is angle yeah that's correct All right copy Right, come in here and just say angle. Let's let me make that. Uh, uh, should I make it 100? Okay, that's what you get for angle 100. And um, I then went ahead and entered the following to call this angle 100. So what I now have what I did was wrote another program that would call this very angle 100 which I will paste up here okay as you can see I've uh, written another program right underneath here that would call this very angle so let me just take that off that would call the angle right there so what I will do is come here save the file and right here I click on uh, call angle 100 let's press enter and that is what you get so the next thing I did was I then change the angle of the angle of this very turtle so let's say F FD make that 60 no sorry RT make that 60 there now move it up FD make that 100 right there and just click on this angle and ask it to develop another design for me I repeat the same thing go back and just say FD 100 angle there but in this case you can see I have not called my very angle right here so what I would do is I will now come back minus 100 to get me back there then call my very call angle and just draw that covers the mistake I made earlier so I will go forward again 100 call the angle there another 100 cold and so on so this is how I managed to achieve the previous uh, images that you guys see so what I'll do right now is just to speed this up and get back to you guys so far this is how my system is looking my diagram is looking so let me click on that angle again there so as you can see it's going to take a lot it's going to take some time to get this completed so that's why is I decide to to speed things up so let's go back so the next thing now is uh, let's just press select FD and uh, select the angle now let me rotate it to, to the left or yeah to the right left is fine now FD again call the angle one more time 
day and this is how you are meant to do the rest of the design okay now I'm just going to speed this up and get back to you guys as soon as I'm done and now for just the finishing torches to this so let's just change the angle and uh, move it move it to approximately 100 and uh, make another turn and right there just get my call my angle again place it there and that will be the end of this tutorial I hope you all enjoyed and uh, I suppose you can do something much better but just before I go I will show you the command one more time here is the command that's the very first one and this is the second one so you can use that to develop something much better so you have a nice day bye